What up, peeps? Welcome to day eight of 31 days of Stephen King horror movies. Let's check in with Mrs. Bones and see what she pulled out the skull tonight. Day eight of 31 days of Stephen King is Storm of the Century. Storm of the Century. This was a mini series, really long, two sided disc. Please flip over to the other side to continue. Anyway, it's a little town in Maine, a little island, and this guy here randomly shows up in the town and just randomly comes up to a little old lady's house who's sitting there minding her business, drinking her tea, watching the news about the weather about a real bad storm coming, rings her doorbell, she answers the door, and he kills her for no damn reason. The little boy playing basketball next door sees her door open, runs over and checks on her, finds her dead, and, and he starts saying some evil shit to him, and he drops his basketball and runs off, and finds this old older man named Robbie, who is the town manager, who looks over shit, and he don't believe him, so he wants to go over and see for a cell. Then the guy starts speaking all this cryptic shit and personal shit that only Robbie should know about his damn self. And so he takes off and calls for the constable or the local sheriff, whatever he is. And he gets there and the guy says, stick your hands out. The handcuffs on, he doesn't fight him. And this calmly goes with him and they lock him up into like this little cage room in the back room of a grocery store take turns looking over him and he whispers shit and makes people do things and makes people write things he likes to say give me what I want and I'll go away and he writes it on walls and he makes other people write it on paper and he got evil eyes and fangs and Comes off as the devil to me. My wife doesn't think that's who he's supposed to be, but I don't know. And all you gotta do is give him what he wants and he'll go away. What the fuck does he want? I mean, I know what he wants. I've seen a movie, but if you haven't seen a movie, you'll have to check it out to find out what the hell he wants. Uh, yeah, he keeps making people kill themselves. A whispering shit. And he says, Give me what I want and I'll go away. He also says at the beginning, I think he says it a couple of times, Born in lust, turn to dust. Born in sin, come on in. Pretty good mini series, aka movie. You gotta flip the disc to watch it all. I wish that they'd release this on Blu-ray because they released Stephen King's It on Blu-ray and you no longer have to flip a disc. It's all on the same Blu-ray. But yeah. Damn good story. One of our favorites. Recommend you check it out if you haven't seen it. That's what we watched. Peace.